GH for STEM Junior's Challenge. From the Brongahapo region of Ghana, we have a student from Best MA Basic School in Brekum. His name is Christopher Nana Boydu. For his experiment, he will be comparing the water holding capacity of three types of soil. The following is required for this science practical. Water, sandy soil, loamy soil, clay soil, three measuring cylinders of the same size, three funnels of the same size, some dry cotton wool, and three beakers of the same size. Soil types are largely for agricultural purposes. Water moves faster through some soil types as compared to others. This is drainage. All the apparatus were of the same size to ensure uniformity of the conditions. First, I'm going to measure equal quantity of the three types of soil. Sandy soil, loamy soil, clay soil. Now, I have my measuring cylinders with funnels and dry cotton wool. The dry cotton wool ensures that none of the soil particles passes through the funnel into the measuring cylinder. I will then put sandy soil in the first setup, loamy soil in the second setup, and clay soil in the third setup. Now I have to measure 50 millimeters of water and pour into the soil sample. Rationale or the reason for carrying out this experiment is to find which soil type retain more water than the other. In the experiment, it was observed that sandy soil has the highest drainage ability. Leaching is very high in it. Therefore, it is only suitable for growing crops that are deep-rooted like cassava. The water holding capacities of the soil types are different. This is because the surface area which supports the water holding capacity is different in all soil types. The surface area of the sandy soil is less than other soil types. More water drained into the measuring cylinder. Loamy soil has intermediate water holding capacity. That is why it is largely used in cultivation of crops. Since in Ghana, most of our crops need medium amounts of water to grow. When we come to clay soil, clay soil has the highest water holding capacity. The particles stick together when water is added and therefore it is used in molding objects such as pots, cooking utensils and statues. It is also used as a binding material. We can study soil and select best crops that will be suitable for each soil type so that we will always get constant supply of food in the country. I'm Gifty Tabua from Best MA Basic School, Brekun. I'm the science teacher. Knowing the type of soil that is on a piece of land will let farmers know the best type of foodstuffs that will grow on that land. For example, rice and sugar will do well in water-loving soil like clay. It's time for Genial's Practical STEM Quiz. Combining different soil types may change the water holding capacity. Which of the following will have the highest water holding capacity? A. Loamy B. Sandy plus loamy soil C. Sandy Now that was an amazing experiment, wasn't it? Can you try this experiment at home? Either by yourself or with your friends from school? Make a video or take pictures of your experiment. Ask your teacher or your parents to help you post the results of your experiment on social media. Tag We Go Innovate so that you can win some fabulous prizes. Don't forget to add your name and the name of your school to your entry 
and hashtag GH4STEM. You can check out any of our experiments at www.wegoinnovate.org and please leave a comment. You can also follow us on social media at WeGoInnovate or WhatsApp us on 055-406-6248. Good luck with your experiment. You can be a junior scientist too.